a little bit faster there, buddy. Thank you. And yes, yes, we have an invi invisible plane. Oh, and then it popped in. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of LEGO Worlds. This is the second in the row and I just kind of wanted to, uh, to do something on this because right now the game has been updated. I thought it was updated in the last episode but apparently not and there's a few new things. Uh, first of all, we have a map in the corner and we have this huge uh, kind of uh, beam thingy which is an awesome little thing because you can see the other green one over there and you can see uh, corresponding dots on my map up here which you can zoom in and out of which is really nice I don't know how far in yeah okay so that's actually very far in and um, but yeah they, they correspond to places that I've been sort of so I can see that from far away um, and you may also notice that things well what the hell happened to the water over there there's like a giant hole in it it doesn't really matter but uh, yeah it's still an alpha, so it's all right. And um, you can now go into the water and explore. So I don't want to go out there as is, like just this guy. I want a vehicle for this guy because if you go down, you can see these blue hearts over here. They are the breath. And I don't know what's happening to the water there, but it looks, it looks a little weird sometimes. Uh, it may be the rendering that's a bit off. I don't know. But uh, yeah, now they actually have underwater stuff which is um, stuff like these huge plants right here. I think these are plants, I'm not quite sure. Let's get a vehicle for this guy actually, because I don't want him to drown. There we go, that's a small submarine. Whoa, what the hell? No, just just get in the submarine, that's, that's, that's all I want you to do. Can I not get in? What? Oh yeah, they, they changed it to Q. Which I don't know why, they changed the uh, interactive button to Q. So here we have Sort of, uh, well, a few things that bother me about this is the flickering of the bricks. I know that it's Lego bricks and everything, which is really nice, but it could perhaps be removed from the view whenever you're in the water, because it actually sort of disrupts the, I don't know, just the sense of you being underwater is, is kind of disrupted uh, in a way. But it is toned out compared to what you get on land. So let's go down here, and I was very, very, um, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, who's that? Who's that? I need to exit my vehicle and go up and check out whoever the hell that was. What? What? Is that the moon? That's the moon up there. I don't know if you can see it. Let's, um... Oh, oh, that's Candyland. Okay, so I don't know where that other dude I saw went, but I want to get to the surface in this thing. Hang on. There we go. So you can just kind of go up. So it's much like the planes and stuff where it's actually very easy to control. I think the game is made with uh, kits in mind, but I don't really know. Let's hop on in here. Let's see, where where am I gonna go now? Because we actually... Uh, well, no, first of all, I wanna say... Oh, hey, I don't think I have this brown bear. I don't think I have that guy over here either. Hi! Oh, I need to defeat you, and you're like a, a bandit or something. Oh, no, okay, I had him. All right. And that guy's coming for me. Okay, I better get the hell out of here. And I don't know why it's lagging, but I needed to uh, to change. What the hell is happening to the frame rate? All right. Um, I needed to change. They still haven't figured out the controls um, in vehicles, but I needed to change my uh, Windows theme to something like Windows 7 Basic. Otherwise, the camera wouldn't turn whenever I right clicked. And uh, that's another stranded deep island. I find a lot of these things. I find so. Yeah. Oh, that's the crocodile. And we have cactuses as well. I don't think I have those yet. Do I? I don't know. Also, they said that the, um, they actually uh, redefined... Yeah, I'm surfing on an alligator or a crocodile or whatever. Uh, it's still as awesome as before. Oh! Oh, that's a spider! Oh my god, that is awesome. Oh, that is... A I can't ride it, can I? No, I can't. But there's wildlife. There's even more wildlife now, which is awesome. And they said that they sort of redefined the entire... Um, well, not redefined, but... Oh, the draw distance is better, too. Nice. <laughs> and this guy is sort of balancing there. Um, but yeah, they sort of um, changed up the exploration a little bit. Why are you coming for me? Please don't eat me, Mr. Alligator or Crocodile or whatever the hell you are. Let's get on the horse instead. I feel a little bit more safe on the horse. Go on the horse. All right. Hey, it thought of something. Oh, it wants an apple. Do I actually have an apple? I don't. 
I don't. Oh, I should find that apple. Yeah, I know you're hungry, dude. I know you're hungry. But they did something to the um, to the exploration of this game so that now you may put in a little bit more work to discover some things. I don't know exactly what you need to do, but um, hey, it's updated. And that's what's important. And I love the fact that you can go underwater and uh, these giant pillars, which, uh, let's see. Yeah, that's over there. Those two. Um... So the red one is my new kingdom, and I believe the green one is my first home. Uh, so, I don't know. I don't actually know, but I want to get to the green one, because that way I can check if it actually is my home. So, I'll be right back whenever I get back to that island. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 I just cut off the recording. Hi, dude! Hi! Okay, so, what happened there, if, if you didn't see it right away? Um... I actually, okay, something weird with the water here. I actually, uh, I'm just gonna go to this one. So I actually stopped the recording and I wanted to get that, you know, on, on recording as well whenever I find that diver because now I found him. That was the dude that, that I was looking out for before. Let's see where he is. There he is. Does that need we don't need, oh, well, does that mean? That we don't need to breathe on the water. Okay, you are walking very, very slow. There we go. So we can actually walk on the bottom. And can we still... Okay. That's a little strange controls here. Because he's... Now I'm pressing jump. And I had to press jump a few times to get up. So I don't know if... Okay, now we're back. With the real controls, apparently. So I guess whenever you walk into it, instead of just jumping in the water from up here... Hi, dude! Hi, how are you doing up there? Yeah, so I guess, um, I guess in a way, you're underwater a lot. <laughs> I guess in a way that's just sort of how it happens. Um, but I love this, I love this, uh, this little diver dude. I guess that's gonna be me from now on. Just at least until I get, oh my god, there are two of these guys. Where the hell do you come from? I don't know. Let's sink to the bottom and go explore. I'm gonna dive down. It doesn't look like we're diving down, but we actually are. Okay, there we go. I want to get over here to this little hollow thing because I think it looks a little bit interesting. Ooh, and there's a crystal. Crystal in here. Okay, so you walk slower when you're on the bottom. At least that's what I think. So get to the bottom. Thank you. Okay, so we are walking just a little bit too slow. Okay, and now he's picking up the pace. I don't know why that is. Why you have to, to be slow first. But, like you can see, we don't have any any um, breath uh, to worry about, I think. Yeah, not with the skeleton either. Why the hell is he standing like that? What is... Is he doing the robot? I don't know. He's, he's kind of... <laughs> he's kind of funky, I will say that. Anyway, let's hop on here. Maybe it's just the water completely disturbed. What? What is he doing? How is he running? You just see that? He's like... Rrr, grrr. I don't even know what that is, but... Oh, hey! Hey, another plant. What the hell? <laughs> he is so strange. He is so strange now. I don't know. Okay, yeah, I don't know. Never mind. Never mind. But I'm gonna get one of these characters here. And I think it's gonna be the diver because then it's kind of official. We're underwater and everything. Let's close the menu. And why can I not jump up now? Do I actually have to... No, okay, I don't. So I guess I'm gonna hold in space, because I held it in there for a little while, and then it let me go up. So, like I mentioned, it's still an early alpha. And uh, even though, I mean, because these things... Whenever you have something coming out, like a crafting game or whatever, which is also why there are so many of them, uh, they tend to go into alpha right away, because there's, there's just gonna be problems with it. But... Uh, I've only I've only experienced a few very very small problems yet. Here's one by the way. I think you have to click this thing and hold it. Yeah, and then he jumps up and then you get under the water again. If you want to get to the surface, that's actually very hard. Okay, there we go. All right. But as soon as you jump in the water, he jumps too. So if you just hold it in for a little too long like I did there, yeah. He's going to jump up and then below the surface again. So let's go to Candyland and get myself a plane and get back to my island, my very home island, which is no longer my home, because I have decided my kingdom is my home. And so, I want the other place with the green rod right over there to sort of be 
a vacation house in a way. I saw the plane. Where did it go? What? What do you want? Okay, never mind. I don't know where my plane went. Have no idea. We're just gonna try this again. Oh, okay. Well, okay, you can walk a little bit faster there, buddy. Thank you. And yes, yes, we have an invi invisible plane. Oh, and then it popped in. Alpha, guys. It is definitely an alpha. Whoa, okay, we, we gotta go over here. Not over there, over here. Okay, so here's another thing that I just found on my way back. Since you can go underwater, I think the water is tending to be a little bit glitchy, but in their defense, I did not refresh my world because I don't want to lose my kingdom. Um, don't exactly know what's over here because this is definitely not my island with my home and everything. Um, so I don't know what's over here. I actually have no idea. Uh, but yeah, the, the green thingy majingy is here, so I guess it doesn't show me my home. I don't know why there are dots on these islands then, because I didn't necessarily build anything on the other, um, on the other. Oh, wait, this may in fact have been one of the places that I explored earlier on, um, before I, I went into the second episode. Like, between the first and the second episode, I was exploring a bit. Just exploring around and see what I could find and everything. And um, I think this is the place. Is there a person standing in the water? Maybe right there? I don't know. But I heard a laugh somewhere over here. So that mushroom is flying. Okay. That's that's okay. That's completely fine. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Oh, no. What? You killed the cave woman. Is there another one? I hear, I hear the laughs. Is that just the skeletons? What? What the hell? Okay, right. Yeah, okay. So that's the skeletons. What the hell? He's super weird. Let's punch you. I hope your buddies are not gonna come after me like the last episode. Are you? Oh, you are. Okay, hey, you know what? Oh, there's two of you guys. Right, so they even look angry now. You see that on their face? They actually looked angry. That's quite cool. Okay, so... Awesome. Let's go. Let's go. Why is that water there? It's just sticking out. Okay. Early alpha, guys. Early alpha. We have to keep that in mind. So, nothing here. So, I want to get back to my kingdom instead. And uh, see if I can build something. Now, I don't want to build anything just, you know, out of the blue. Which is why I asked you guys in the end of the last episode to give me sort of suggestions for, um, for stuff and things that I possibly could build. So, I'm still waiting on those. If you even watched that far. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. This is uh, going to be a small sort of cutscene right now, and once again, the, the uh, in invisible plane. Okay, now it pops in. I don't know why. I don't know why it does that, but this is going to be a small cut right here. This is my kingdom, and whoa. Okay, the sun is coming up. That's quite nice. I just want to land this thing, and uh, for those of you who, who, haven't, um, who haven't seen my kingdom before, this is it. This is where I was in the beginning of the episode. And if I can get up to the highest point, it would be nice to have a jetpack in this game. I don't know if there actually is, but if, uh, if I can get to the highest point, I can sort of show you a small view of my kingdom. I don't have to get to the highest point. I think I just go up on this tree here. That's the second highest point, I believe. Yeah. So here is my kingdom. Behold it all. This is absolutely amazing. We have a few cave systems, so much space to build and everything. So... I don't know, I mean, I think I'm gonna wait until the next episode to actually start building stuff in here, but it's very, very cool, and before I go, I just kinda want to uh, show some stuff with, uh, for instance, virtual floor, so you can build a virtual floor and uh, start building on that in the air, so that's quite nice, and uh, I'm gonna turn that off again, and now the undo and redo buttons actually seem to work, so that's quite nice, I just wanna get back, whoa, ah, okay. That's another thing. Whenever I go into the brick building here, if I'm standing on this thing, like, it's it's very limited with this situation, but if I stand here and I go into the brick building, he's gonna sort of fly up, and if I go back in any way, he's gonna move his position. Now, if you were up high somewhere, that would suck. That would definitely, definitely suck. So I think it would be nice just to, uh, yeah, to, to kind of, yeah, to redefine that, basically, to, uh, to, 
make him have the same position. I can't even talk today, but... I guess this was just a very small episode uh, showcasing the uh, the actual update and the, the sort of glitchy water. I don't know what happens whenever I um, I enter a new world. Can I come back to this one? I don't know. But if any of you guys know, let me know in the description below. The description. Why do I keep saying description when it's the comment section, clearly? So, <laughs> yeah. I guess we are ending it where we took off last time, but now only as the diver. You know what? Actually, my kingdom... Needs to recognize me. So this, this is the true owner of the kingdom of the land. So thank you everyone so much for watching this small sort of LEGO Worlds update video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.